Another cost behavior classification is what's called a step cost. As the name implies, I'm guessing you could probably figure out what that graph looks like, but let's talk about what step costs are first. These are costs that remain fixed in total for a limited range of activity and then increase to a higher cost level when the upper limit of the range is exceeded. So for example, this one is would be like a preschool class. Teachers have a responsibility for so many students and that's all they can have responsible, responsibility for based on law a lot of times. So they can only have maybe 15 students per one teacher. And the salary of the teacher is going to remain constant no matter if they have one student or 15 students. However, the moment the 16th student comes in, that means that they have to bring in a second teacher for that class, which means that the salary is going to go up because now you have two teachers. And that's going to remain the same from students 16 through 30 and so on and so forth. So if we were looking at this from a graph, this is what it would look like. It would look like steps. You have the first range at the bottom and then the moment that uh, level of activity uh, passes its threshold, then it moves up. And then again, once it passes its threshold, it moves up again and then up again and so on and so forth. So that's what step costs are.